Hi there everyone, welcome back again to Engineering Preetam and in this PTC Creo Parametric series where we are covering PTC Creo from zero. And this I would say is 70th video of this series where we are covering pattern tool. And so far I would say we already have covered four or five variants of pattern. So if you want to see other variant of pattern, then do check out the link that I have added in the description of this video. Now let's come back to this video topic, which is how to create point pattern. And before we directly jump into it, let's understand point pattern. In PTC Creo, the point pattern is used to create features based on predefined points. These points act as a location for instances of feature, allowing you to distribute features in a custom pattern. This is particularly useful for irregular pattern or when you need a precise placement of a feature. So let's see how we can do that with the help of an example. And for that, first of all, as the name suggests point pattern, we're going to create those precise points. So uh, here I have just selected the sketch mode. And now we are in sketch environment. So uh, here I'm going to use geometry point. If you use this reference point or construction point, if you have seen my previous videos, then you might be aware of the scope of construction point is only within sketch however when we draw these geometry point they have a scope beyond sketch so this is what we need and let's say these are the precise point where we would like to create certain instances after selecting these points we can come out from sketch now uh to make it simple i'm gonna use hole and let's say i would like to place hole here and now i obviously can customize it let's say this was a flat hole with throughout depth now after creating this hole let's click ok and the same hole is required on all these point location and that's why we have created this point right so what i'm gonna do here is i'm gonna click here on hole and then let's click here on pattern now what we need to do here is we need to click here on the pattern type and let's select this time point now i'm gonna select this whole sketch or any of this point now here you will see the preview of the pattern again you can customize it by making a select so in this way we can disable it but let's for the first time i'm gonna keep it enabled now let's click ok and there we go guys here we can see we have successfully created these holes at the point or location which was precisely calculated or defined using points and the good thing about it, anytime you can go back to sketch and let's say, you know, you would like to change this location, let's say from 23 to 25. Now let's hit OK. And now here you will see the position of this hole uh, will itself shift. Maybe the change was not that much dramatic. Let me use dynamic edit and now let's change this. I'm going to make it 30. And now here you will see the hole is now 30. So in this way guys we can utilize point pattern. Point pattern as I said allow irregular and non-linear pattern that are difficult to achieve within traditional pattern tool. Although I would say the alternative could be table type pattern but then again you know you have flexibility to go through that route or this route. I hope guys you find this video helpful and informational. If so, then please do like and subscribe to Engineering Pritam to follow complete PTC Grio Parametric series and other engineering topics. And I will catch you soon with one such another video. Till then, you take care and bye-bye.